Today we are celebrating Wednesday in the first week of Advent, and I've selected our first reading from the book of the prophet Isaiah. On this mountain, the Lord of hosts will provide for all peoples a rich feast, uh, rich in food and choice wines, juicy, rich food and pure, choice wines. On this mountain, he will destroy the veil that veils all peoples, the web that is woven over all nations. He will destroy death forever. The Lord God will wipe away the tears from all faces. The reproach of his people will be removed from the whole earth, for the Lord has spoken. On that day, he will say, Behold, our God, to whom we look to save us, this is the Lord for whom we looked. Let us rejoice and be glad that he has saved us. For the hand of the Lord will rest on this mountain. My brothers and sisters, the word of the Lord. Well, we are now deep into the first week of the Advent season. And our readings, uh, especially the readings uh, from the prophet Isaiah, uh, are meant to be guides that will help us to enter more deeply into the spirit of the Advent season. The prophet Isaiah is a very important companion on our Advent pilgrimage. He's a prophet that points out the way to us way to a deeper, a more satisfying Advent experience. One of the dimensions of his prophecy is to try to awaken our imaginations, try to awaken our desires, to help us to come closer to what the hungers of our heart really are. As we continue in this Advent season, I encourage you to spend some time with the prophet Isaiah and sit quietly and to listen to your own hearts as to what your own hearts hunger for, what they thirst for. And as the Lord has promised, he will set a banquet before us. 